It is a great joy to be here in the presence of God, family and friends, to bless the union of Jay and Tricia. Tricia, you're a true queen to me. I love how you can light the room up and light my day up with just your voice and your smile alone. I recollect waking up and I can't even fathom of not having you by my side. I promise to love and cherish you even when things are hard. Let's y'all more and more. I wish that you could see yourself the way that I see you. But then again, there are probably things in me that you see that I overlook. Janice, I'm motivated by the person you, you are. I remember the first time you held my hand. And from that moment, became my, you became my best friend, the father of my kids, my protector, my heart, and my partner in crime, and now my husband. someone who makes me a better person but still loves every version of me and accepts me and inspires me today I choose you I choose your smile that brightens up the room your soul that brings me peace and all your spending habits and all the skinny pants too God gave me you and our beautiful kids for a divine purpose in a moment in time when I didn't really know where my future was going. So Johannesy, Sir Thomas Johnson, <laughs> I shine for you and I shine because of you and I promise to shine forever with you. I love you. a lot as a child. He was on maybe 27 medicines a day, every day. When he said, Mama, he said, the Bible said, if you have faith of a mustard seed, you can say to this tree, move, and it'll move. He said, and the Lord said, I will heal you. He said, so I don't want to take that medicine anymore. He said, God is going to heal me. He said, so can I stop? And I looked at him. I said, do you believe God is going to heal you? He said, yes, ma'am. And from that day, he never took any more of that medicine till this day. That's his faith. And he still has that crazy faith to this day. He believes when nobody else is going to believe. And I say all those things to say this. In a marriage, there are going to come days when it's going to be a little rainy and you're going to need somebody to be your sunshine to help you smile and that's for both of you when you don't feel like it i remember the first time you came to dallas and i knew from the, the moment i laid eyes on you that you were the person i wanted to be with and I, i'm more than grateful for you i thank you for teaching me different things you teach me how to be patient how to love how to be kind and without you i don't know where i would be at um trisha thankful to make you my wife and i love you with all my heart I'm happy for him. I'm happy for Trisha. I'm happy that he found Trisha because Trisha is honestly a great woman, Jay. She's, she's great to you. She takes care of you. And I want you to know that Jay is also the most loyal person I've ever met in my life. Your heart is so pure and you have always been like a sister to me. Throughout our ups and downs, I love you, and I pray that God blesses your marriage and this new journey for you, too. Today is a day that both of you become a team, and I need you guys to remember you can achieve wonders together, okay? 
Trish, you're an amazing friend, an amazing person. As frustrating as Jay may make you, I need you to be strong for him. And the only thing that I, I ask God when I go inside of the room is, let, let me take my little girl to the aisle. I want to take my girl to the aisle, me and God. And after that, six years have been passed. And um, six years have been passed, and, and, I, and I asked God to take my girl to the aisle. And he, he saved her life on that time. And uh, after he saved her life, uh, they still give me Aliyah and Jeremiah, and today I walk her to the aisle. Without the presence of the Lord, we cannot do nothing. So the presence of the Lord is here. And I want to tell you, friends, marriage is the most honorable state created by God. God is the creator of marriage. So he has the model. He has the ingredient to make this work well. So the Lord has to be in the marriage. As they united in holy matrimony and made promise before God and these witnesses, I, as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, are now pronounce you husband and wife. Marriage in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. So these vows are never to be broken. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no one separate. You can kiss your bride.